Hey everyone, today I'm back with my weekly cash stuffing for my sinking funds. This is gonna be for the third week's income of February. And I forgot to mention in my last video, but we are working with a total of $1,109. I did stuff 850 of that into my bills and cash envelopes. If you guys haven't watched that video, I'll link it in the card above. Uh, but we are putting a remaining $259 into our sinking funds. And just really quickly, I want to thank you guys so much for all of the new subscriptions, for all of you guys who have been here, been going through the journey with me. Um, I think we're almost to 800 subscribers, which, which just kind of blows my mind. I just can't believe that many people want to watch me count money, but I am I'm so humbled and I'm so appreciative. And um, I will be doing a giveaway whenever we reach 1,000 subscribers. So I'm kind of working on that, trying to get that all set up. But yeah, thank you guys so, so much. So I cannot wait to do that. Uh, getting right into it, we are going to go ahead and do the Saveopoly challenge first, which is what I always do. The reason being, um, I always leave a leftover for myself from my income. This week it's $39. And once I do my Saveopoly challenge, I deduct that from the leftover. And then anything that is left over after that, I just put into other envelopes. So I always like to start out so I know how much we're working with. Let's go ahead and pull it out of here. If you guys want to join me on this challenge, I always link the Saveopoly. Um, I always link the shop where I found this challenge in the description box so that you guys can join me as well. Let's go ahead and pull this guy out of here. And... I forgot my ex, my expo marker gave me one second. I'll be right back. All right, y'all. I am back. I got my expo. I got my die ready to roll. Let me go ahead and erase this. We were on save $10 last week. So let me wipe that off. I usually have to use my shirt. And I have to say, I really am liking this challenge. It is really fun. So if you guys are looking for a fun challenge where you're surprised at the end of it by how much you save because you don't know what the amount is going to be, Definitely recommend. Um, so yeah, we were right here. Let me go ahead and roll the die. Six, one, two, three, four, five, six. So we will be saving $35 this week, which is great. Make sure that's right. One, two, three, four, five. Yes, okay, $6. I mean $6, uh, six spaces. So we're saving $35. Cool. Let me go ahead and put this away. And I'm gonna go ahead and write $35 here. And I'm going to go ahead and stuff that as well. So we'll do 20, 30, and 5. And I will organize it later. I'm just going to shove it in there for now. Put the board back in there. Alrighty, so that leaves us with $4 remaining. Let me figure out really quickly where I want that to go and I will be right back. Alrighty y'all, so I did put the $4 into back to school. So we're gonna go ahead and stuff that in there. But first, we're gonna start off with the original binder. It's OG. We're gonna get right into Christmas. Christmas is gonna get 10 bucks this week. And I'm not able to stuff um, what I really want into these envelopes this week, but that's okay. If you guys wanna watch the video where I lay out all of my new sinking funds for the year, I will go ahead and link that above. That way you guys can see how much I actually, am I actually trying to put in these. But this week, Christmas is getting its $10. So let's do, let's do, let's do a $10 bill. This one's kind of crappy, but that's okay. So Christmas now has, oof, it's so not good. Christmas now has 50, 70, 90, 100, and 510, $110. Up next, essentials. Essentials is getting $10. And I had to take a, a good amount out of this today. I went to Target and we all know what happens whenever you go to Target, so. Usually I use this folder for vitamins, feminine hygiene products, 
um, things like that. So I did need a few of those things. And then I also got some like body scrub and some shampoo and conditioner. But we're going to go ahead and throw $10 in there to get that um, beefed up a little bit. So let me go ahead and put this $10 bill back and just grab a 20 so Essentials now has 20, 30, 1, 2, 3, 4. 34 bucks. I really love Target though. It's just like a whole vibe whenever you go in there. You get your Starbucks, you get your cart that rolls perfectly, and you're just in there for hours. I actually took my son and he hates going shopping with me for that very reason because I think I probably sniffed mm, 30 different types of shampoos and conditioners, but... It's fun. It's fun to go in there. All right. Uh, up next is his folder. So he is getting $25 this week. So 20 and a five. And he now has one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight hundred, twenty, forty, sixty, eighty, eighty five, ninety, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, nine hundred dollars. And you guys, I did order some prop money, so that should be coming soon. I'm super excited about that. I will let you guys know how it looks, and it should be in some of my um, future videos. Up next is Vacation. Vacation is getting 25 as well. And unfortunately, the money that I have in here is not going to stay in here because I'm still paying back my credit card from the Mexico vacation I took. But let's see how much we have to go towards that. So we have 50, 100, 20, 40, 60, 80, 200, 20, 40, 45, 50. So we have $250 to go towards that, which is great. I am planning another vacation, you guys. Um, Oct in October, I will be turning 30. So I will be planning my 30th birthday vacation, which I am trying to get to Europe for. If everything goes right and the COVID restrictions don't uh, permit me from going there, I will be going to Europe in October. So we really need to go ahead and get Mexico paid off and then we need to beef this one up. Up next, clothing. Clothing is not getting stuffed. Clothing really isn't a big envelope for me, you guys. Um, I really don't have to, to buy a lot of clothes. And then my son has the uniform at school, which is great because he only needs his like semi-annually. I usually just buy like spring clothes and then winter clothes like pants and shorts. Uh, so this one's not getting stuffed, but insurance is, and it is getting $35. So 20, 35. Let's see. All right. And car insurance now has 1, 20, 40, 60, 80, 90, 200, 5, 10, 15, 20, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 30. 230. Alrighty. Up next is birthday. Birthday is getting 12. And I mentioned this to you guys last time. Um, the next birthday that I have is my mom's and it is in April. So... I should be able to save up enough by then. So twelve dollars. Um, let me just go ahead and grab. No, I'll just go ahead and put five, ten, eleven, twelve. We'll just have a lot of ones. Okay. So birthday now has twenty, twenty-five, thirty, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, forty. 40 and birthday and she's actually taking herself to Vegas this year so I'm super excited for her she's gonna go on like this whole bingo like bingo finance I don't know what you call it but she's gonna go to Vegas and play bingo so she's super excited uh, up next is household household is getting five so let's just go and go ahead and throw five ones in there so one two three four five which brings household to 15. And usually I, I've mentioned this before, but I use this folder for things around the house like um, decorations or the last time I dipped into this was for air fresheners. So just anything we need around the house that isn't groceries basically. Hustle, hustle is getting five. So let me go ahead and put five ones in that one as well. Ooh, I might have to 
make some change. Let's see. I will have to make some change. Give me one second, guys. Let me make some change really quick because I don't have enough. And I'll be right back. Alrighty, y'all. So I did make some change. Hopefully it's enough. We'll see. But we are going to go ahead and put $5 into Hustle. And like I said before, I did go ahead and buy prop money. So I pull it out of here. Anything for my channel. So Hustle now has 5, 10, 11, 12, 13. Okay, up next is car maintenance, and car maintenance is getting $3. Let me pull this out of here first. So let's see, one, two, three. And it now has 50, 70, 80, 85, 6, 7, 8, 9, 90. And let me go ahead and just, let's see, 10, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. And let's just pull a 20. Okay, so 90 in car maintenance. Up next, diapers. Again, this is for future children. And we're going to put two in there, which brings diapers to 10, 20, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 29. And the lastly in this binder is wedding, again, future wedding, and it is also getting two. So one, two, and it should have the same 29, uh, 10, 20, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 29. All right, that is it for that one. Let's go ahead and move on to the new sinking funds binder. Starting off with annual fee. This is for my credit card and it is getting two dollars. Let me pull this out of here. So one, two, which brings annual fee to 10, 11, 12, 13, 14. Okay, up next, holiday fund. We're not putting anything in holiday fund, but we are going to put two dollars in registration so one two which brings registration to five six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve thirteen fourteen okay dental fees is getting skipped this week as well as tattoo fund uh, but we are going to go ahead and put that four dollars into back to school so I think I might have to, yeah, I think I might have to put this and grab this. Is this going to be right? We'll see. Uh, let's see. Back to school now has 20, 30, 35, 40, 1, 2, 3, 4, 44 in back to school. Oh, this is right. Okay, cool. Uh, next up is emergency fund. And it is getting $22. And you guys, I do have an emergency um, account in my bank. And that's another reason why I was buying the prop money. That way I could use the prop money to reflect what I actually have in my bank account so you guys can have a better understanding of my finances. So I do have a vacation account, I have a car maintenance account, and I have an emergency account all in my bank. Uh, but this week, emergency is getting its 22, like I said. So let's do 1022. And if you guys don't know, I am doing a little challenge where I am saving $22 a week for the year 2022. That way I have some money to put into my emergency fund. So it now has fifty, seventy, ninety, one hundred, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty. So one hundred and twenty. And then, let's see, beauty or self-care, as I have it here, is going to get 10. So let me go ahead and put a 10 back and just grab a 20. And beauty now has 20, 40, 45, 50, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. And I mentioned in my last video, I did take my nails off, and I'm thinking about getting them done. Not acrylics, because it just messes up my nails so bad. I have, like, really thin nails, and they look terrible afterwards. But maybe doing like a dip powder. I'm thinking like a dark forest green. I don't know. But lastly, we have the Roth, which is getting the remaining 50. So let me go ahead and stuff that in there. 
So 20, 40, and 50, which brings Roth to 1, 2, 3, 350, 370, 390, 410, 30, 50, 70, 90, 510, 530, 540, 545, 550. So 550 in Roth. All right, you guys, that is it for our sinking funds. And I will be doing a cash unstuffing Probably, I'll probably be filming it next week. Usually at the beginning of each month, whenever I have a lot of my bills due, I do bill exchanges. So I'll do a cash and stuffing and a bill exchange. So be on the lookout for that. And again, if you guys did not watch the video where I stuff my bills and my cash envelopes for this, this week's income, I will go ahead and have that in the description below as well. If you guys have made it this far, go ahead and drop a green heart emoji. I really appreciate you guys for watching these videos through. If you're still here, thank you so much. Um, I will be doing some new videos coming, sh coming shortly or coming soon to kind of break up the monotony of just the ca weekly cash breakdowns. So be on the lookout for those. Um, but until then, I will see you guys in my next video. I hope you all have a fantastic week. I'll see you next time. Thanks. Bye.